WLRadio.com. You're here with your main man, Hollywood. And today, man, we got Takashi69 dropping a new single. And it's HWLRadio.com. And I don't just get that name from nowhere, man. Go download the radio station at, at HWLRadio.com. Do it for all devices so you can rewind and fast forward the music. But what I can tell you for me listening to this snippet of Takashi's leaked music is that he's one of the new hybrids. He's one of these new hybrid niggas out here. Well, I mean, the nigga's untouchable because the nigga, he'll got, try to fight you. So evidently, he, he ain't that that scared of pussy. But, you know, he'll try to fight you. The nigga will tell on you. And the nigga will come back out and make some more gangster music. I mean, they, man, they making these new niggas, man. These niggas are something else. I'm like, dang, boy, that's a dangerous nigga. That nigga will kill you, snitch on you. <laughs> <laughs> nigga will kill you and snitch on you, man. That's the wrong nigga to hang around. Like, man, I don't even want that nigga to know me. Like, you said my name to that nigga, man? You said my name around him? You don't ever say my name around Candy Man. <laughs> These niggas walk around here like Candy Man, man. I'm like, boy, these niggas is untouchable out here. I don't know who raised them or who birthed them, but man, like, I know they asked for a refund. Look, they they trying to find that receipt. <laughs> But I can tell you this, man. The nigga has that same energy. Because, you know, normally when something like this happens, in the past, the nigga come out and, you know, he ain't rapping like even Troy Ave. He ain't fully, fully, fully snitched. He just said some shit. But he ain't never point a finger and name a name. That's that's totally snitching. He just insinuated the story. It's his own damn tape. His own damn tape. He talking about, I don't know who, but I was I, I was fighting and all this stuff. That is not snitching. So, you see how when he came back out, his music kind of took a hit because that was affecting him. <laughs> Since Takashi 6'9", nigga, he get out. He drop another hit like, man, man, F them niggas, man. Man, they locked up. Like, shoot, man, I'm free. I'm out. Like, I want to hear this nigga's first interview for real. Because, boy, 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 the energy he coming with in this song, nigga, you'll think that this nigga stood tall. <laughs> Ain't say a word. He came home and he free now. <laughs> After 25 years. <laughs> Somebody stop him. Hey, get him out of here. Get him off of my TV. <laughs> This nigga's not real, but I tell you one thing. The people is going to accept him because he still can make a hit. And he got that energy of this new generation, the music they like. Watch what I tell you. He about to have another number one song. But that's just for me knowing music. But that's going to be the show for today. And I'm about to hear. He like a, he like a, uh, how can I say this? What is somebody? He like R. Kelly. You know how, like, it's a mixed emotions. Like, some people are like, man, ban R. Kelly, ban him, ban him. And they like, man, you just can't ban his music is so good, man. He can just touch the kids. Like, you idiot. Like, <laughs> somebody slapped him. But that's it, man. I'm out of here. That's the situation that's going on.